and welcome back to my office. Good to see you. I wanted to make a video today about a little story. <laughs> I guess it's now two or three weeks ago I sold a basil brush hand puppet sort of thing. I'll find the picture, I'll find the eBay listing and pop it in here so you can take a look. So there it is. I was very happy. I sold this uh, lovely little vintage 1970s puppet for £30. Now regular viewers of the channel may have seen the video where I was picking orders the day when I sold that and I picked him off the shelf and I was showing the function where you pull this little ring and pull a string and he he talked or he should have talked but he wasn't working but anyway before I shipped him off I showed him on the video and I managed to break him in fact I'll see if I can find the clip and I'll show you so he is a hand puppet put your hand in here and then you can work his mouth <laughs> and he does have a drawstring I know I've shown this before but Seriously? The ball just fell off. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. And the, the string's gone up inside his tail. Oh, what? So, yeah, that happened. I managed to pull the drawstring ring off and the string went whizzing back up inside his tail. I couldn't believe I did that. So anyway, I messaged the buyer and said, explained what had happened and, and gave them the option of cancelling. But thankfully, they said, send him anyway and I'll see what I can do, see if I can repair him. So yeah, very happy about that. Sent him out, didn't hear anything back. Until recently. And we've now had a message. Let me show you the message. So it reads, Hi Nick, just to let you know Basil Brush had a small operation and is working perfectly. Ha ha boom boom. And he does more than that with the drawstring. Carefully picked his tail apart, opened the voice box, took it out and used strands of dental floss, which is very strong and will not snap. Reattached the ring, then hand sewn him back up with the proper colour thread. He feels himself again. Thank you for sending him to me. He also says, you're a bit crafty. Ha ha bang bang. <laughs> so I just wanted to update you that he is alive and well and has pride of place. It was a pleasure to fix him. All the best, Alec. So that really made my day. And I replied to that message saying such that, you know, I'm so pleased that a, he's happy with his purchase now. B, he managed to restore it and it's working. So it's been restored back to its original functionality. Now, when I had him and the drawstring was working, the voice box wasn't functioning. So he's managed to repair the whole thing and he's now apparently saying various phrases. So really happy. And I thought that was the end of it until today. And we got another message. So let me show you that. So we had another reply to my message, which reads, that is lovely, Nick. Pleased it cheered you up. He just does not say, ha ha, boom, boom. He also says, ha ha, bang, bang, and says, oh, you are quite foxy. <laughs> I have a birthday coming up, Nick, with some lovely, kind, hard-working people and going to get him behind the bar serving pints at a local place and wine and wine behind the bar. It is Daisy Bar and Kitchen Italiano Ristorante. Yes, Italian food. We all love basil. <laughs> Cannot wait for these people to laugh. Nobody expects him to make an appearance. It will be a right laugh. All the best, Alec. So isn't that fantastic? I just love when you get a little bit of insight into the life of these items that you sell on, you know, beyond making a few quid out of it. It's lovely to know that these items are being used, they're being loved, people are enjoying them. And in this case, 
it's been restored back to full working order and is now going to have a whole new life serving pints behind a bar <laughs> by the sound of it. Um, I thought that was a lovely little story and it's it's brought such a smile to my face. I don't know if Alec is a viewer. He's never mentioned the YouTube channel. I don't think he is. Um, hopefully he'll find this video. Uh, if you are watching Alec, please drop me a message. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I will share another one of my videos up here. Please take a look at this one if it looks interesting for you. Take care and I'll see you soon.